A lawyer has told of the shock of learning his flat was destroyed in the Lancefield Key blaze. David Curry, 31, was at a pantomime in Dumbarton when the fire broke out and didn't get the news until the interval. There were no casualties or injuries in the fire, which at its height had 60 firefighters working on it, but the building was badly damaged. Up to 200 residents are thought to have been affected. He said, I left my about 6.15 p.m. to go to the pantomime and it seems as though the fire started about 6.45 p.m. Although I heard other residents across the river saying that they saw it started earlier, just after I had left. The panther started at 7.30 p.m. and the interval was an hour later. I hadn't checked my phone, and when I did I had loads of missed calls, people asking me if I was safe or in the flat. David rushed home to find that his home was ablaze. He said, I couldn't get into the flat and went to the room the emergency services had set up to register other residents as safe. They didn't have much information, just that the fire had started in a flat and spread along to the flats on either side. When they said the numbers, I knew then that one of the flats majorly damaged was one of mine. After doing so, David went to the other side of the Clyde where he watched the flames engulf his flat. He said, it was a very sad experience, watching it burn from the other side of the river. I've got no idea how the fire started, and no one seems to have any ideas. At this time of year, I guess it could have been Christmas lights. Maybe someone decorated and there was a spark. In all the years there has never been a fire, then all of a sudden the Christmas decorations go up, and there is a fire. Appreciate what you have while you have it as you never know what's going to happen tomorrow. The worst part is that I had to leave the pantomime early. So I still don't know if Cinderella got to the ball David joke. For more on this story, visit the news article link.